If you've been subscribed to my channel for a while, one of the things that I love to showcase and share with you guys are UI libraries, component libraries, blocks, whatever it is to do with UI clean and simple that I can use in my projects that you can use in your projects, I love to share. And today, boy, do I have a banger. This is by uh, this gentleman right here. I don't know how to pronounce this, so I won't butcher it, but my African brother cooked probably one of the best um, Shatsi and blocks that I have seen and it's completely free. I don't know if you know this, but most component libraries will give you the components for free. And the business model is they charge for blocks, which are basically these templates pre-made that you can customize to your heart's desire. But you get a full landing page here with various variations, various variations, that's a funny choice of words, but with variations that you can use absolutely for free. So we have hero sections, we have logo clouds, we have feature sections, and you know some of them like, for example, this right here, this is super clean to me. The image tilted over there, the bento grid features, at insanely beautiful content where left side image, right side text, left side text, right side image, like beautiful layout, stats, team, right? Like this is so well done and just it saves you so much time testimonials call to actions footer pricing we have everything we need to create a landing page and that's literally what we're going to do right so we have this installation command here i'm just going to copy this i have a fresh next.js project i'm just going to paste that there and it's probably going to install uh Shatsy and ui for me so i am very happy and cool with that we're going to let that we're going to do pmpm run dev and I'm just gonna import the hero section, which is the component it created in my page.tx. If I go to components, I see hero section. Let's go localhost 3000. Let's refresh and we get an error. And that's because the, it needs something for motion primitives. Um, and we're just going to install this ourselves. I think maybe the CLI is missing it. Um, listen, this is free, so we are just going to do this ourselves. So I'm going to do not motions. Oops, 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 oops. We're going to do pmpm install motion, right? And I believe if we go here and I run this command, I will add the text effect that I need. So I'm just going to add type in that say yes. It's installing everything I need. Perfect. So if I go back to pmpm run dev. All right, we're working. Let's go back to our home page. Let's refresh. And now it's saying I need animated group. Let's search animated group. And that's right here. And we're just going to paste that command. In fact, I'll do it in a separate terminal that's been installed. And then last, I just need to add the image, I believe, right? Perfect. So I'll go to the, where's the next config? And then I just have to add the image domain here, but this is the domain. It's supposed to, yeah, so it's gonna be rest.cloudinary.com. We're gonna save that. And if we refresh here, look at that. Look how beautiful that is. Look how simple that is. You can swap the image for whatever you want. And then we can go back here. And then let's say, okay, we have our hero section. Uh, what's next? I think it should be features, right? So we'll do, the bento grid one where's the bento grid one this one right here so i'm just gonna again i copy that command paste it here right let's see the component it's called features eight so go back to pages features um is it feature section is that how the file is named um yeah features eight and then let's just close that and let's go back to our localhost 3000 look at that look how quick that took me let's keep going we're going to we have features uh we don't need content right we'll just add stats i, I like this one right here so i'm just going to copy that paste that in the terminal hit enter that's installed uh stats is installed so we're going to add the stats component um stats section is what it's called we're going to hit save And we have our stats section here. Perfect, Look, it just looks good. And then team, um, do I wanna show off my team? No, I don't wanna show off the team. We'll do testimonials. And for testimonials, I want something small. 
um, I like I like this one right here. So we're going to paste this. Now, I might not be following landing page ethics, but I'm just trying to build a really clean landing page and I'm literally doing it in a few seconds, in a few minutes, sorry. So testimonial section and we'll just import this quickly. I do not want to use Copilot. What's this called? Um, wall of love section. Okay, so we'll do wall of love section and we'll import that, save. We go back here. Look at that. This looks like a landing page that just raised $20 million seed round. And it's only taking us a few minutes. And then we'll do a call to action. Let's see, we'll do this right here. I like that. Paste. And we're going to see the new component here. Call to action. Is it called CTA? Or call to action. Okay, save. I'm not even going to look at the thing. I'm just going to go to footer. Let's add one last footer. Let's add this one right here. Something simple and calm. Paste this. And then we're going to add our footer section. Save. Now let's go back to our localhost 3000. And look at that. All within a few minutes of just copy and pasting, I have a beautiful landing page. And there's again, you have the pricing section that we didn't add. We have FAQ, we have like the compare table, we have login, sign up, contact. This is by far one of the best UI templates I've seen, and it's completely free. Shout out to my African brother again. Make sure you give him a follow, please. Screenshot. Search him, follow him. He deserves the he deserves the love. This takes time, and not only does it take time on his end, but he's taking time out of our ends to build beautiful landing pages. So go out and build. The links will be in the description below. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe. I'll see you in the next one. Peace.